So this is why I left Delphi and Micah Miller and a lot of these crime cases. It's the creator wars. Well, hello, hello, my silky friends. I'm going to keep this as short and sweet as I possibly can. Um, I know so many, and yeah, I apologize. <laughs> like, it's a hot mess. I kind of rolled out of bed not too long ago. My yard guy's here. So if you hear a lawnmower in the background, that is what that is about. And uh, yeah, you get the bed head, the whole nine yards. But I was just pretty fired up this morning. And I, I just wanted to talk to you because, you know, as you know, and sorry, <laughs> my background, this is for my other channel. This is Scully. If you are on Silky Southern and you don't know about my other channel, that's my co-host, Scully. Um, and uh, he sometimes causes quite a problem, but not today. You're going to keep it quiet, right, Scully? All right, so, um, yeah, and I have been working really hard on that channel for the last couple of months. It's doing really well, but that is not the reason. Could I fit that in along with Silky Southern? Yes, I could, but, um, you know, here's the thing. I said this in one of the lives not too long ago. I have found that most creators are criminals. A lot of them have an actual criminal background, and a lot of them are just, you know, they have a criminal heart. And so, you know, I've been thinking about this, and this is why I have taken a step back, and I'm trying to think what I want to do with this channel, because as much as I love advocacy, it's really difficult out here. Um, the people who want to slam you are so many and so many lies and so you know i've already been thinking about this and taking a break from it and deciding where i want to go so this morning i'm flipping through youtube and i see that cj is live and um not at the protest which i don't watch a whole lot of the protest and i'll tell you why in just a minute but, you know, basically he was sharing some really hard things that he's been going through um, there at Myrtle Beach, which I I'm just going to be honest, it doesn't surprise me at all. Um, when I first started co covering my... Yeah, I can't talk. <laughs> I need more coffee. Um, when I first started... Co okay, I give up. When I first started covering Micah Miller, um, I was planning a trip out there and, you know, there were, I really wanted to make several trips if I couldn't do like one whole long week. And I really had this in the works. And then I started watching some of his protest uh, coverage. And from the probably about the second week, probably about the second time I watched it, I had this terrible gut feeling that things were going to go wrong and that it was going to get ugly. And that there were a lot of things, like there were a lot of people in those early days that I would see on camera and I would just, you know, I'm not a psychic, okay? I just have very good discernment. And I would see certain people I want to, and I would say, oh my God, this is going to be a problem. This one is a lot, like, I just know. I know what I know, okay? I know things. And the more I thought about it, the more I thought this is going to get ugly. And I, you know what? I've had, I've been in the Delphi community so long. I know ugly when I see it. I can see ugly a long way coming down the road. And I thought, no, I'm not going to go. I'm not going to go. And, you know, I, I don't know what to say about that. I hate that CJ is going through this. I hate that um, he's maybe been deceived. I don't know if that's the right word or used or whatever by people. Um, you know, I can say this. I, I haven't even listened to it. Okay. I hear references, but I'm not seeking out information because I know CJ. Okay. I've worked with CJ and 
there was never any time that he was anything other than a perfect gentleman, okay? So any thoughts or talking about anything like that? No, that's a no, all right? Um, this kind of, this kind of sickness, cancer, you know, amongst creators and people wannabes and people who just want their 15 minutes of fame i mean you know i i can't work with it and y'all know i do not work with people i rarely have someone on i'm rarely on somebody else's show i don't work with people and there is a reason now you know that i've started working with brain bungler and colton um and we will be doing we're starting a new podcast um I'm not even sure. We're still <laughs> we're still trying to figure that out. Um, but I d I do know them, <laughs> as y'all. If you know the backstory, you know I know them well, and I have no problems doing a show with them. Uh, but the thing of it is, y'all, it's really hard when you are trying to bring attention to a case. And, you know, there are some good cases out here right now. I would love to dive deeper into Sonia Massey, but I'm kind of afraid the same thing is going to happen, that there's going to be a lot of ugly. And at this point, I don't even know what to say. I don't even know what to cover because literally it's so evil out here amongst everyone the community yes you get trolls saying terrible things I, I don't care i don't care what the trolls say all right but it can not only be dangerous physically but to your reputation and um i don't know a kudos to all the good creators out there and and i'll, I'll give you a, a big round of applause but the number they're tiny tiny amount of people who are who they say they are and it's not just a persona i mean i am what i am and and I, and most of the time that's a hot mess okay but i do believe in justice and advocacy um clearly i do not make money from this channel so <laughs> i mean i don't know what to tell you um i i just wanted to let you know i'm not gone forever I may be doing some more of social commentary, um, maybe a little politics. I really don't like politics. I don't know. Maybe some more storytelling. I have tons of stories about all kinds of stuff if you want to hear it. Um, I've lived a very interesting life, and I know some very interesting people. So um, I, I don't know. But at this point, I, I just really want to apologize to the good creators out there. Um, you have it rough and i am sorry i am sorry that people are so ugly and hateful that they feel this is the only way they can be heard or get attention or whatever i don't know so anybody who you know wants to refute some of this come at me i don't care all right i don't care and if you like two ghost stories <laughs> go to avalon cottage my other channel um i have fun over there uh here is very important to me my heart is with silky southern and it's just trying to find a place that is safe for the community for you lovely people that keep up with me i want safety for everybody so and justice all right i love you all so much have a wonderful weekend i'm gonna throw this up real quick I will be doing a live sometime soon, so watch out for notifications. Have a great, wonderful day, and whatever you do, just stay silky.